Welcome to Job Form. Today's tutorial is going to be on how to fill form fields according to predefined conditions. So let's go ahead and open up a new form. Let's grab this one and edit form. Let's drag in some elements for this example. And let's drag in three number elements. So let's drag one, two, and three. We'll name this one to total. So we're going to grab these two numbers and we're going to add the total right here with conditional logic. So let's go ahead and open up settings, conditions. We're going to select update calculated fields and we're going to select number. If it's filled, we're going to do a calculated field value. So let's add the field variable from field three and we're going to add the other field number four and it's gonna add the summary to the total let's save this conditional logic let's go preview this form okay and if we say for example if two plus three equals five and if the numbers change it'll keep adding the total and this could be useful for many use cases now let's do another example let's delete this one let's go into the builder and let's get rid of these. Now let's go ahead and up a single choice, for example. Let's change these options to say, for example, this could be anything, but these are just examples. And let's get rid of this. One. Okay. Now what we're going to do is if this is filled, we're going to add something to the email. Let's go ahead and go into settings, conditions, update calculated fields and in this case we're going to say if this one is equal to for example gmail then we're going to do a calculated field value and now we're going to type what is going to be added in that summary so let's just say gmail.com all right so if it's equal to gmail it's going to write this and it's going to add it to the email field let's save this conditional logic let's go ahead and preview it and if we select, for example, Hotmail, nothing is going to happen. But if I select Gmail, that's added by default. Now, this could be used for several reasons. It could be, for example, if you fill out a name with a certain name or just if it's filled out, we can fill out another field easily with this conditional logic. Well, that is how you fill form fields according to predefined conditions. Well, we thank you all for watching. This is Jock Form.